dear students welcome to the session in continuation to problems under equations reducible to exact equations let me consider few more examples on equations reducible to exact equations so let me consider the problem solve 3x square y power 4 plus 2xy dx plus 2x cube y cube minus x square dy equal to 0 so this given equation is of the form of mdx plus ndy equal to 0 so let me write this the given differential equation solution part the given the given differential differential equation is 3x square y power 4 plus 2 into x square dx plus 2 into x cube y cube x cube y cube minus x square minus x square dy equal to 0 so let me call this as equation number 1 let me call this as equation number 1 so this is of the form this is of the form yam dx plus yam dy is equal to 0 so where yam where yam so here yam is 3x square y power 4 plus 2 into xy and yam is 2 into x cube y cube minus x square so i have identified m and l from this given differential equation so let me check whether the equation is exact or not so the condition is differentiate m partially with respect to y and l with respect to x if they coincide have the same value same expression are equal then the given differential equation is exact o solution is can be determined easily so do f by do y is 12 into x square y cube because y x is constant with respect to y we are differentiating m partially with respect to y then here x is constant that is 2x then similarly if you differentiate m with respect to x y is constant so this is 6x square y cube minus 2x as we can see they are not equal right? 6x square y cube 12x square y cube only <coughs> plus 2x and minus 2x there so they are not exactly equal so this shows that do m by do y is not equal to do m by do y so therefore the given differential equation y is not exact therefore the given differential equation a uh, given equation given equation 1 is not exact is not exact <coughs> so we shall try to find integrating factor which makes this equation exact on multiplication on multiplication so there are two cases we have discussed in the last class let us find integrating factor using those two cases so consider consider 
rho n by rho y minus rho n by rho x divided by y. Now this is going to be rho n by rho y is 12 x square y cube plus 2x minus rho n by rho x that is minus 6 x square y cube plus 2x divided by n n is a 2 x cube y cube minus x square 2 x cube y cube minus x square Okay, so if you simplify, this is going to be <coughs> 12 minus 6, 6 x square y cube, uh, 12 x square y cube minus 6 x square y cube is 6 x square y cube, then plus 2 x plus 2 x plus 4 x divided by 2 into x cube y cube minus x square. So if I simplify this, I can take 2x outside here, then this becomes 3x into y cube plus 2 divided by, I can take x square outside here, this will become 2x into y cube minus 1. Now, this is not going to be a function of x alone. It is not possible to obtain a term where we have only x term because this is not going to be simplified. Right? So we shall change the ratio. Now let us consider <coughs> consider consider now do n by do x minus do m by do y divided by m. Now this is going to be do n by do x is 6 x square y cube minus 2 x. 6 x square y cube minus 2 x minus do m by do y minus 12 x square y cube x square y cube minus 2x minus 2x divided by m. m is 3x square y power 4 3x square into y power 4 plus 2x1. So this is your this is our m. Now let us try to simplify this. A uh, 6x square y cube minus 12x square y cube that will give you minus 6x square y cube minus 6x square y cube minus 2x and minus 2x that will make minus 4x uh, divided by so here I can take x into y outside x into y outside when I take x into y outside, this term becomes 3 into x into y cube plus 2 plus 2. Now let me take uh, 2x minus 2x from the numerator. If I take minus 2x outside, this will be plus 3x y cube, 3x y cube plus plus uh, I have taken minus 2 that is plus 2 plus 2 divided by x into y into 3 into x y cube y cube plus 2 so I can cancel this factor and I can cancel 1x so this is equal to minus 2 divided by y a function of y alone. So through this ratio I did not get a function of x. 
where I did not get, I should check with the another case, so which heals a function of y. Okay. So this is, let me call this as g of y. Say function of g would be a function of y would be y would be. Now with this uh, g of y, I can find out the integrating factor i f, which makes the given differential equation exact on multiplication. So therefore, integrating factor is e power integral g of y d1. So this is equal to e power integral g of y is minus 2 divided by y dy. So this is going to be e power minus 2 integral dy by y. So this is going to be e power minus 2 integration of dy by y is log y. So this can be written as this can be written as y power minus 2. So my integrating factor is 1 by y square or this is 1 divided by y square. My integrating factor is y square. Now multiply I have multiply I have that is 1 by y square to the equation 1. So if you multiply to the equation 1, so that, then I get 3x square y square after multiplying 3x square y square, 3x square y square plus 2x by y plus 2 into x divided by y dx plus 2x cube y square 2x cube y square minus x square by y square minus x square divided by y square into d1 equal to 0. So this is the differential equation obtained after multiplying by the integrating factor 1 by y square. Okay. Now again these are the forum mdx plus mdy equal to 0. So let me call this as m1 dx plus n1 dy equal to 0. So m1 is equal to 3x square y square plus 2x by y and n1 2x cube y square minus x square divided by y square. Okay. Now let me differentiate m1 partially with respect to y. When I differentiate partially with respect to y, x is constant, so 6x squared y, 6x squared into y, 3x squared into 2y, so 6x squared into y, then uh, 2x is constant, so minus 2x divided by y square. Now similarly, if I differentiate n1 partially with respect to x, I get y is constant partially with respect to x. So this is 6x squared y squared. So this is y squared, sorry. 6, uh, 6 x squared. Square gets cancelled 2x cube y. 
So with respect to n, if I differentiate partially, I get a 6 x square into y, y is constant, then this is minus 2 divided by differentiation of x, 2x, that is minus 2x divided by y square. With respect to x, y is constant. So minus 2x by y square. Now as you can see, dou m1 by dou y is equal to dou n by dou x. Okay, so therefore, dou m1 by dou y is equal to dou n1 by dou x. Dou n1 by dou x. So each is equal to 6 into x squared y minus 2x divided by y square. 2x divided by y square. Okay. That means this equation, we call this as equation number 2, is exact. So this shows that this shows that equation 2 is exact. Equation 2 is exact. And it's a solution and it's a solution is it's a solution is uh, integral m1 dx keeping y constant constant plus terms of n1 not containing not containing x dy x dy dy is equal to some constant c. Now let me uh, substitute for m1 and n1 as for the specification. If I do so, I get therefore integral of m1 m1 is 3x square y square plus 2x divided by y with respect to x keeping y constant constant plus terms of n not containing x see both the terms contain x so 0 0 terms dy is equal to c. is equal to c. Now let me integrate this keeping y constant. So this is 3 into y square is constant into x cube divided by 3 plus <coughs> 2 divided by y is constant. Integration of x, x square divided by 2 plus 0 is equal to c. So I can cancel 3 and 2 here. So the remaining part is x cube into y square plus x square divided by y is equal to c. R, if you multiply the word by y, R, x cube, y cube plus x square is equal to y to c is the required solution of the given differential equation 1 or you can further simplification also you can do uh, x squared if you take outside this will be x into y cube plus 1 is equal to y into c or c into y c into y c 
see into y is the required solution of the given differential equation one, which is the which is the required solution solution of the given differential equation differential equation one. So we can conclude like this. Now let me consider another problem. Equation 1, given differential equation 1, 
exact on multiplication by the integrative factor. Now consider, consider the ratio arbitrarily dou m by dou y minus dou n by dou x divided by n. Okay. Now dou m by dou y is here only 4 into x plus 6 into y dou m by dou y minus dou n by dou x minus 2x minus 2y divided by n. n is x square plus 2x plus 2x Now let me simplify this. Let me simplify. So this is equal to 4x minus 2x plus 2x 6y minus 4y plus 4y plus 4y divided by so I can take x outside here I can take x outside here so this is x into x plus 2 x plus 2y further I can write this as 2 into x plus 2y divided by x into x plus 2y. So I can cancel this factor. So this is equal to 2 divided by x purely a function of x. So let me call this as f of x purely a function of x. See. Eh? Okay. Let me call this as a function of x. Only function of x. Function only a function of x. function of x. Okay. Now let me find out. So therefore the integrating factor is e power integral f of x dx. So this is going to be e power integral fx is 2 divided by x 2 divided by x dx. So this is e power twice integral dx by x or this is e power 2 into integration of dx by x is log x. So 2 into log x or you can write this as x square. x square. So my integrating factor is x square. Now let me multiply this equation 1 by x square and see what happens. Multiply equation 1, that is given differential equation 1 by x square, integrating factor x square. What will happen now? So this will become 4 into x cube y, 4 into x cube y plus 3 x square y square. 3 x square y square minus x square into x x cube dx plus this is x square right, into another x square x power 4 plus 2 x y that is 2 x cube y dy equal to 0 dy equal to 0. Okay. Now, again this is of the form. You call this as equation number 2. Again this equation is of the form. m dx plus n dy equal to 0. To differentiate, yeah this m with this m. So let me consider this as let m1 be equal to 4 x cube into y plus 3 x square y square 
minus x cube. And let me differentiate this. And n one b x power four plus two x cube into one. Now let me differentiate m one partially with respect to y. With respect to y, x is constant, so this is four into x cube, four into x cube. So with respect to a y. x is constant eh? so there is 6 x squared y 6 x squared y with respect to x y x cube x is constant so plus 0 then similarly partial derivative of n1 with respect to x here y is constant so i get 4 x cube here 4 into x cube with respect to x y is constant again plus the 6 x squared y 6 x squared y. Okay. So now, if, as we see here, they are equal. Therefore, dou m1 by dou y is exactly equal to dou n1 by dou x, and both are equal to 4 into x cube minus 6 into x squared y. So this shows that. Equation two is exact. This shows that this shows that equation two, that is differential equation two, is exact. Is exact. So the other solution and its solution and its solution and its solution is and its solution is integral of m1 dx keeping y. Constant, constant, plus terms, terms of n one not containing, not containing x with respect to y is equal to some constant c. So let me write down. So therefore, m one is four x cube, four x cube, y plus three x square, three x square into y square minus x cube dx. So keeping y constant. Y constant plus terms of n one not containing x, so both the terms contain x, so zero terms, so zero dy is equal to c. Okay, let me integrate this one. Let me integrate this one, keeping y constant. So four into y is constant. Integration of x cube. x power four divided by four, then plus three y square, three y square into integration of x square, x cube divided by three, x cube by three minus x power four. X power four by four plus zero is equal to c. Okay. Now you can simplify. So three three can cancel. So therefore, x power four into y plus 
x cube y square minus x power 4 by 4 is equal to c r 4 into x power 4 y plus x cube y square minus x power 4 is equal to 4 into c is the required solution of the given differential equation which is the which is the required solution of the given equation it is differential equation one Okay, so let me consider two more examples. Example 4, solve solve x square plus y cube plus 6x dx plus y squared x dy equal to 0. So let me write the given differential equation initially. The given differential equation is the given differential equation is x square plus y cube plus 6x dx dx plus y squared into x dy equal to 3. Call this as equation number 1. This is of the form. This equation r. This is of the form. m dx plus n dy equal to 0. The given equation is of the form. m dx plus n dy equal to 0. So what are my m and n? So here m is x square plus y cube plus 6x and and n is x into y square or y square n. Now let me check whether the partial derivative of m with respect to y is equal to partial derivative of n with respect to x r naught. So differentiate m partially with respect to y. With respect to y, x is constant, so you get 0 here. So 0 plus 3 y square, that is 3 y square, 3 y square again plus 0, then dou n by dou x dou n by dou x is y square 3 y square is not equal to y square therefore dou n by dou y 
is not equal to dou n by dou x. Therefore, the given equation, therefore, equation 1, that is the given differential equation 1, is not exact, is not exact. So let me try to find the integrating factor which makes this equation 1 exact. So let me consider, consider, consider the ratio dou m by dou y minus dou m by dou x dou n by dou x divided by n which is equal to dou m by dou y is 3 y square 3 y square dou n by dou x is y square so minus y square divided by n n is x into y square or y square into x okay. now further further this is equal to 3y square minus y square or 2 into y square divided by y square into x y square into x you can cancel y square so I get 2 divided by x which is purely a function of x let us say is equal to f of x only a function of x only a function of x okay. <coughs> so therefore by integrating factor in this case is equal to e power integral f of x dx so this is equal to e power integral f of x is 2 by x the 2 divided by x dx so 2 is constant so that I can take outside e power 2 into integral dx by x so this is e power 2 into dx by x integration of dx by x is log x and therefore I can write this as x square so my integrating factor is x square again as in the previous problem so this is x square now let me multiply this x square to equation 1 so multiply x square to equation 1 and check for exactness again so multiply multiply 1 a given differential equation 1 means given differential equation by integrating factor which we have tried that is x square multiplied by x square then then we have tried uh, 1 is here only I am multiplying by x square so x power 4 x power 4 plus x square y cube plus x square y cube y cube uh, plus 6 x cube plus 6 x cube dx plus y squared into x into x square y square x cube y square x cube dx dy equal to 0 dy equal to 0 so call this as equation number 2. Call this as equation number 2. Again equation number 2 is of the form m dx plus n dy equal to 0. So to differentiate with this m, let me call this as m1. So let m1 be x power 4 plus x square y cube plus 6 x cube and n1 y square x cube n1 
y square x cube y square x cube now let me differentiate m1 partially with respect to y with respect to y x is constant right? so with respect to y so the 0 plus 3 x square y square 3 x square y square and this is again 0 here yeah? then if you differentiate partially n1 with respect to x so this is going to be dou n1 by dou x is 3 y square x square or 3 x square y square they are equal so therefore therefore dou m1 by dou y is equal to dou n1 by dou x uh, each is equal to uh, 3 b x square y square that means equation 2 is exact uh, this shows that this shows that this shows that equation 2 is exact and its solution and its solution is integral of m1 with respect to x keeping y constant keeping y constant plus times of n1 not containing not containing x dy is equal to c is equal to c okay. now let me substitute m1 and 1 as per the specification so therefore m1 is x power 4 x power 4 plus x square y cube plus 6 x cube dx where y is constant y is constant plus terms of n one not containing x so n1 contains x so zero terms so dy is equal to so let me integrate this keeping y constant here uh, x power 4 integration x power 5 divided by 5 plus y cube is constant into x cube divided by 3 x cube divided by 3 plus 6 x power 4 divided by 4 plus 0 is equal to 6. Now, if possible, let us try to simplify this. So I can remove 2 here and this becomes 3. So what is left here? x power 5 divided by 5 plus x cube into y cube divided by 3 plus 3 into x power 4 plus 3 into x power 4 divided by 2 is equal to c which is the required solution of the given differential equation so which is the which is the required solution of the given differential equation what
Then if we consider another final example on equations reducible to x. topic equations reducible to exact equations solve solve y more 4 plus 2y dx plus x into y cube plus 2 into y power 4 minus 4x dy equal to 0. y power 4 plus 2y dx plus x cube x y cube plus 2y power 4 minus 4x dy equal to 0. Okay. So, this is the uh, <coughs> given equation. So, the solution for The solution part, the given differential equation is, so let me write down the given differential, differential equation is y power 4 plus 2 into 1 dx plus x into y cube plus 2 into y power 4 minus 4x dy equal to 0. Call this as equation 1. The given differential equation is 1. Okay. Now this is of the form. This is of the form m dx plus n dy equal to 0. <coughs> Let me identify this m and n. So here m is y power 4 plus 2y and n is x into y cube plus 2 into y power 4 minus 4 into x. Now let me differentiate m with respect to y partially and n with respect to x partially and see whether they are same or not. So differentiate m partially with respect to y. So with respect to y x is constant. So there is no x here. So 4 into y cube plus 2. And if you differentiate n partially with respect to x keeping y constant. So this is y cube plus with respect to x this is 0 minus 4 0 minus 4 y cube minus 4 y cube minus 4 okay. So this shows that therefore dou y by dou y is not equal to dou n by dou x. So they are not equal. That means given equation 1 is not equal. Therefore, therefore equation 1, equation 1 is not exact. Not exact. Now let us try to find integrating factor using the two cases which we have already discussed so that this becomes exact differential equation on multiplication. 
Now let me consider the ratio. First arbitrarily dou m by dou y minus dou n by dou x divided by n. Let me consider this ratio. So this is equal to this is equal to dou m by dou y is 4 into y cube plus 2 minus dou n by dou x minus y cube plus 4 divided by n. n is x into y cube plus 2 into y power 4 minus 4 into x. So if you further simplify, if you simplify 4y cube minus y cube that is 3y cube, 3y cube. Then 2 plus 4 that is 6. Minus 2. Do m by do y, 4 y cube plus 2, y cube minus 4. Do m by do y, 4 y, okay, minus plus 4, plus 6, divided by x cube, x into y cube, plus 2 into y4, y4, 4, minus 4 into x. So this cannot be reduced to a function of x, will not reduce to, cannot be reduced to function of x. So we shall change the case cannot be reduced reduced to a function of x. This cannot be reduced to a function of x. So therefore, we shall consider the next case. So consider consider dou m dou n by dou x minus dou m by dou y divided by y. So this is equal to dou n by dou x y cube minus 4 y cube minus 4 minus dou m by dou y minus 4 y cube minus 2 minus 4 y cube minus 2 divided by m. m is y power 4 plus 2 into 1. Let me try with this. So y cube minus 4 y cube is minus 3 y cube. Eh? Then minus 4 minus 2 minus 6 divided by so I can write this as y into y cube plus 2 y cube plus 2 y cube plus 2 okay. Now in the numerator also I can simplify I can take minus 3 outside minus 3 in that case this is y cube y cube plus 2 divided by y into y cube plus 2. So I can cancel this factor y cube plus 2 and I get uh, <coughs> this as minus 3 by y. Let us say this is uh, equal to g of y, a function of y only, okay? function of y only, function of y only. <coughs> okay. Now, in this case, if, so therefore, Integrating factor if is e power integral g of y dy. g of y 
dy. So this is e power integral <coughs> minus 3 by y minus 3 by y dy minus 3 by y dy. minus 3 by y dy and this is equal to e power minus 3 dy by y is log y minus 3 log y is equal to y power minus 2 y power minus 2 okay. <coughs> y power minus 2 so Multiply 1 multiply 1 the given differential equation 1 by y power minus 3 rho. So what happened? Uh, if I multiply by y power minus 3, this becomes y y plus 2 into y power minus 2 or 2 by y square. So I multiply equation 1 by y power minus 3. I get first term y 2 into y power minus 2 r 2 divided by y square into that. I get this equation dx plus I get x then 2y minus 4 into x divided by y cube dy equal to 0. Call this as equation number 2. So if you carefully multiply, you get this equation. R 4x by y cube. So I get this equation. Let me call this as equation number 2. And again, these are the form m dx plus m dy equal to 0. So let, let m1 be y plus 2 divided by y square and n1 be x plus 2y minus 4x divided by y now let me differentiate m1 partially with respect to y. I get 1 here minus uh, 4 by y cube minus 4 divided by y cube. So integration of 1 by y square is minus 2 by y cube. So minus 2 into plus 2 that is minus 4 y cube and similarly if you differentiate n1 partially with respect to x, I get 1 here and y is constant with respect to x of 0, then minus uh, y is constant, so minus 4 into 1 divided by y cube. Okay. So they are equal, they are equal. So therefore, dou m1 by dou y is exactly equal to dou m1 by dou x. Okay. So therefore, 2 is exact. Therefore, equation 2 is exact. And its solution and its solution is and its solution is integration of m1 with respect to x keeping y constant keeping y constant plus integral of terms of n1 not containing x not containing x into dy
into dy is equal to c. Okay. Now let me substitute for this m1 and n1 as per our specification. So therefore, integral m1 is y plus 2, y, 2 by y square, y plus 2 divided by y square dx, so where y is constant, where y is constant, plus terms of n1 not containing x. So there is one term which is free from x, so integral 2 into y dy is equal to c. Now let me integrate keeping y constant. So both are constant. So y is constant, 2 by y square is constant. So 2 plus uh, y plus 2 by y square is also constant. So constant into x is the uh, uh, integration of this. So therefore, after integrating, we get y plus 2 divided by y square into x plus 2 integration of y is y square divided by 2 is equal to c. Or this is x into y plus 2x divided by y square plus y square is equal to c. Or multiplying by x y y square throughout y square throughout or x into y cube plus 2 into x plus y square into y square y power 4 c into y square is the required solution of the given differential equation. So which is the required which is the required which is the required solution solution of the given differential equation one. So with this I will stop here and continue the next topic in my next class. Thank you.